Previously, on Legend of the Wild City. You emerge into this kind of like underwater city, uh, but you also notice that it almost looks like a ruined city to a degree. Uh, wow, what a shit bro, bro. <laughs> What? What? And then you see a small mer boy uh, swim out in front of you, and he stops dead in his tracks. You hear what sounds like a like a dolphin, and then the kid like perks up and says, uh, "We have to go now." And uh, he starts Please. to swim away. No. <laughs> maybe a hundred yards behind you. You see this very large dolphin uh, with kind of these like black stripes on it. And then like holding on the back of the dolphin is a very large uh, merman. The dolphin begins to charge right at you very fast. Okay, oh, no. that's the mayor. Ha, that's <laughs> the mayor. Looks like maybe a bell tower or something. Can I ring a bell real quick? Uh, <laughs> we arrive at a bell tower. You know, one of those like yodel horns next to Perfect. the bell. I'm gonna speak into that real quick. Attention, uh, mer people! You see, uh, what looks like five or six like mer guards swim up. The mer guards are now swimming much faster towards you with their tridents leveled at you. Uh oh. The big guy on the dolphin. We can defeat him. We're under martial law. He works for us. <laughs> Fuck. The guards all rush in and grab you very forcefully, Marta. Is the dolphin still hypnotized? I'm gonna swim up to his little face and I'm gonna say, Hey pal, that old woman is very huh. important to me. Do you wanna use your big tail to maybe like slap all of the guards that are holding her? You see this dolphin incoming. Guys, 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 guys. Marta, just grab on. Just makes this huge current with its tail uh, and blows all all of you apart. Skip with his skip with his super fast speed is just gonna like take off to go retrieve Marta. You see that small mer lad again, and he says, "Hey, I'm gonna give you one more chance. If you don't want to get caught by those guards, follow me." All right, let's do it. Okay, fine. I'm not gonna like it. Uh, you follow this uh, mer lad through a corridor. Alexander, however, as you start to swim out, uh, grabs the grabs the remnants of this big guard's tail and just like puts it in his bag. I'll turn around and notice it. Yeah, is that a fetish thing? Were you trying to be secret about that? Oh, crispy. It's covered. Alexander it's... passed you without saying anything. Okay. Weirdo. Yeah, what a weirdo. Oh, human. Yay! Hello. Howdy. Hello. <laughs> Hi. Welcome to Under the Ocean with us. <laughs> so, uh, we are unfortunately missing our our powerful and loyal Marta tonight, uh, but our we're going to soldier on. <laughs> She's right our star here. player. <laughs> our star fighter. She's, yeah. <laughs> our, most, our most powerful uh, combatant by far. But the show must go on, so we're going to go on. Uh, and that brings us to now, under the sea, here with you. I don't know, do you guys want to say anything, or do you want to just roll into it? I'm hyped. Uh, I'm ready to go. I'm hyped. Let's go. Let's, go. Let's, fight All right. Let's, go. Let's do it. Uh, so you follow this young mer lad that, uh, that poked his head out uh, and ushered, tried to guide you to some sort of safe situation. Uh, you follow him uh, through corridors and alleyways of this underwater city, unsure of where you're going. But as you follow, he begins to speak. And he says, uh, my name is Merlin. I'm a mer person, obviously, but uh, my Wait, people Wait, does everyone's for... name start with mer? Well, no, I wish. Is that, that like be... a thing here? Like mer Steve, mer Mike. It's, it's actually, mer I really mer wish Mike. that. It's kind of like tacky, and my parents kind of got a lot. Of, I got a lot of crap for it growing up here, um, but oh, were you yeah. bullied? I well, uh, I mean, I don't want to. I don't want to harp on it. You know, that's that's in the past. We have bigger things to worry about, and so I'm just gonna stay focused Fine. on this. But Fine. maybe if you guys wanted to like adopt a mer thing to your name, it would really make me fit in a lot better with uh, with everybody back to at HQ. You? I'm not here to do any favors for a small boy. 
Yeah, Look, for I'm contractual married. obligations, I have to go by Nomeo because it's like a branding thing where if I were to change my name, it wouldn't be promoting my movies. So I, I kind of have to stay Nomeo. Okay. Um, I mean, I guess I, I understand. No, that's fine. I, I, sh I shouldn't have expected you to to do anything for me that's anyway we have bigger problems um so we've lived here a long time and we had like unlimited magical power uh because of this this like magical source that we have in our in our king's palace uh but the the magical device which we use to harness that energy broke a few years ago and so now energy has just been radiating out uncontrolled and it's really deteriorating our people in our city and that's why those guards were so angry and that's why that dolphin was so weird and uh yeah so i'm leading you right now to kind of the resistance if you will and uh oh we're here and uh you guys <laughs> exit uh have reached the outskirts of this city uh and you see merlin go up to what looks like just a regular rock uh, and he uses his tail to kind of make this like a, you know, the the ribbon shape that people use for like awarenesses a lot, uh, or yes. like the, yes. the kind of Christian fish. So it's that turned upside down. So it's just like a kind of inverted that. Um, and he makes that shape and uh, you see this like magical tracing on the rock and the rock begins to open up. Uh, and you swim down this uh, underground corridor into uh, a bunker, which you'll see a map of on your bottom right. Uh, and you see mer people bustling about uh, with a kind of relaxed urgency. Uh, nobody is like pulling their hair out, but people definitely have a purpose. And he says, uh, this is uh, this is our resistance, I guess. I mean, we don't really have a name for it, but here we are. <laughs> you guys have movies down here? Uh, uh, we got Fighting. I would love a bathroom if, if there was a place for me to freshen up. I came from a fight. I've been underwater for I think a day. Right. Well, you're in the ocean, so we just at, we we just go outside, and then you you can do that there. Give uh, ham just like down here. Bottom. Sorry. Give ham down here. I've been craving ham for some reason. I don't know. I don't know what ham is. What's ham? Oh, we leave. Oh Something my like god. That. I yeah. feel bad for you. Uh, as you're talking, uh, a large man comes over, uh, and you notice that it's like definitely the the only a really full adult looking person in this room. Uh, and oh he, says, uh, he says, he says, <laughs> Merlin, who are these? Uh, and he says, uh, Oh, oh, yeah, uh, these are some landwalkers I found trying to escape the enforcers. I brought them here, thought maybe we could help each other. Uh, he looks you up and down and says. Uh, well, I don't know what you're here for, but I can tell you one thing. You're certainly not getting out while all of this is happening. Hmm, of what? I don't like the sound of that. Oh, oh I'm not trying all to of, All of what? Our king has gone mad. Our city is deteriorating. Raw magical energy is radiating everywhere. And the enforcers right. have a complete control of our entire land. That, that you don't know what damn it. Mad. I mean, well, that, this place uh, is going I'm not gonna lie. We were kind of on a, a mission of our own, and this sounds like a like a you problem. I, well, not to look. be, not to be that guy, but we we were trying to find a lost and magical city, and this city is clearly found. And a magical, it, it, I guess. I I mean, you said radiation. I, mean, I, guess. I guess one could consider radiation magic, um, more of a science to leave. Uh, we are not going to keep you here by any means, but I'm telling you, if you swim out of that rock door and try to return to what, what I would assume is your ship on the surface, you will be caught and you will be sacrificed to the void. Such an attitude. Mm. The void. And the void. That's bad? The, yeah. The void is, did Merlin not tell you? Uh, the void is what we call the uncontained magical energy. It's basically just like a big black hole. And our mm. king has been throwing people into it to try and satiate it. Which is... Mm. Of course, That's uh, yes. I can't imagine it ever being good. 
or happier or more creative than I am. I don't know. Or hmm. I can present you with another option. Okay. I mean, I, I guess. Help. You can right. help us contain the king and contain this magical energy. And then, once the enforcers are now trying to catch you, you'll be free to go. So that's kind of more of an ultimatum than anything. You're uh, blackmailing again, us. You're free to go now. The door is open. I am simply telling um, you that what is most likely to happen is your capture and sacrifice. Skipjack, are there any, how are you feeling are there about any, this void? Oh. Um, are there any Hold beautiful on. ladies uh, around that Skipjack can see? <laughs> <laughs> um, not really. There's mermaids, but none of them, for some reason, none of them strike Skip. Uh, they're all... Okay. Yeah. Jeez, Skip. <laughs> Sorry. So Skip, Skip, Skip's gonna, like, look around, and he's gonna be like, Look, guys, I don't think this place has anything for us. Okay. <laughs> Plenty so, of beautiful so mer women here. The void, then? There's plenty of fish in the sea, but the ones for me aren't here. Hmm. This is a first, and I feel like it's gonna get our asses kicked in the end, but I, I don't... But I don't want to go know. into the void. But don't you want to be an adventurer? Isn't that your whole thing, other than, you know, yes, women? Yes, I guess you're right. If I... You're right! You're right! If we <laughs> save this city, it adds another accolade and, to me, and then I have more accolades to add to my family name, and then uh, that might find me more beautiful women. Is there anybody Bronx, around here who's, you're, who's yeah. seen the void who can maybe like give <laughs> us just like a rundown of what it looks like and like the vibe? Uh, yeah, uh, the the large merman. Um, looks behind him and gives kind of a whistle and you see a uh, a shaken a like a looking somewhat mentally unstable and shaken but still able to function uh mer merman come over he's like very scrawny uh yeah what well, you wanted to know about the void yeah just like what's the vibe just in general what's the vibe? if you were to uh, vibe if you were to vibe check the void what would what yeah. would yeah have you have you ever uh, have you ever heard a thousand screams and then been stabbed a thousand times and then lit on fire and suffocating all at the same time? Did that happen in your movies, um, Nomeo? Uh, I don't think that happened in any of my movies. Do you have anything that's like, kind more of relatable? Is it like I had to spend like five hours in a makeup chair one time because I was doing this like Christmas movie where I like had a, I was, it was kind of like the gnome version of the Grinch. Yeah. And I, that yeah. really sucked. Uh, right. Is it kind of like that? Did they like, did they like spoon your eyeballs out in the makeup chair? Because that would definitely be like it. Yeah. No, it was more just like I was kind of like sitting there for a long time and they would like, there was this one annoying part where they would like have to glue on these like, these like prosthetics on my face and it didn't really like hurt right. but it was just it was like, like hydrochloric super acid no it was, like... it was more just like regular glue but it was just oh. like so slow and no, i couldn't this like doesn't eat really or drink like for a while hmm no, right, no, well, this it's, really uh, it's a little <laughs> would, it be like, would it be like the time the only woman i ever truly loved um perished yeah yeah that sounds that sounds right. Not to reveal and, too much about my backstory, but Ooh, yeah, opportune time. Well, that, that, that was about the good. worst thing that ever happened. Thank to you, me, thank you. Rather you will not... never escape. Thanks, Aiden. Thank you. Thanks, yeah. Aiden. Thank you. Uh, well, it sounds good and so fun I'd, time if you're into that sort of thing. I'd rather, I'd rather that not happen to me again. So I, I say we we help. All right. Fair. Here's. No, uh, Bromps and Skipjack, and I guess Marta too. Marta is being really quiet. Is anybody else? Marta, it's that? so quiet tonight. Catatonic. She had a really rough something. time last episode. Yeah, that's true. I guess she Maybe might just be just, like. Maybe uh, she's just, uh, you know, re revealing, reveling in what happened last time. She always, she got caught pretty bad. That's true. Yeah, she's probably just Marta. recovering. Anyway, guys, 
hear me out on this. I think it seems like we are probably not going to do the void thing, but these guys really seem like they need our help. So I think we kind of act wishy-washy and we see if maybe we can get like a deal out of this. Like we help them and they do something for mm. us, you know, because, you know, they kind of need I us, like right? that. So I think we, we leverage that a little bit. We say, hey, we're thinking about going to the void unless... I don't know, you guys have something really cool to offer Something to us. sweeten the deal, perhaps a weapon or eternal glory or women with tails. Yeah, something like that. What do you, how do you, how do you feel about that, that idea? I feel good yeah, about that. You know, we can try and swindle. We haven't really, uh, we haven't really been evil this whole, this whole adventure, so maybe it would be nice what to about us? some of those muscles. That's true. I was completely Cindy? morally righteous the entire time, including that time when I almost left that one guy to die. That was <laughs> no, totally that's, fun. Oh, that's right. I did good. almost leave Big Kyle to die, too. You're, you're both very boring and too goody two shoes. I think yeah, that's the point. I think it's time right? that we maybe act a little edgy. All right, let's let's go talk to yeah. this guy again and, and see if we okay. can we can finagle Break. a little deal here. Great. So do we just turn around? <laughs> like <laughs> yeah. right there? We were just having this conversation at full volume right next to him. He was very fortunately involved in very heavily involved in another conversation with somebody. Oh, oh, uh, yes. So, I, I heard you talking, but I didn't. Yeah, so, yeah. we're really thinking about yeah. this void. It's sounding really cool. Um, ah, so, I mean, I, I think we're probably just going to go with the void. Um, it sounds like you guys really it's, need us or whatever, but... Yeah, you could use our brain, our brawn, and our just, beast celebrity oh, wait, status. Wait. But, our uh, brain, our brawn. Yeah. Oh, oh, I, we could oh. use all Should of I the things now? Your brains, prompts, clever puns, all of it. Look, how can we... I, we are very powerful magic creatures. We Ooh. could perhaps give you some of our shape-shifting abilities, if that's... Whoa! If that would be I enough. mean, I that like... sounds... That sounds That could be pretty, pretty good. Cool. It's pretty good. Pretty good. We can, pretty we can cool. give you... Look, we can... Mer people can enter land and sea freely because we can change our tails into legs and vice versa. We can give well, you look that. Look at me! I'm breathing underwater, aren't I? True. You are, True. yes. But we can so... give you, we can give you a, a mer tail at your very mm. will to swim past as well, and your two friends oh. can breathe underwater with yes. you. Basically, could I, we can could make. Could I put it anywhere? People. Okay. I, it's Could I put magic. The tails it anywhere. Just... So if I, I wanted, you mean? if I wanted tails for arms, could I make my arms the mermaid tail? I, it's I a never heard or considered that. Right now, I, it's a that's a terrible idea. But yes. Or, or what if I kept my legs and then I had like, what if I kept my legs and then the tail was like just another tail out of the back, like a dog's Again, tail. Terrible so I could idea. propel myself yes. and then still walk. Is that a thing? It just seems like bad engineering on a bodily function, you know. I'm just stance. wondering. It's hypothetical. I, it's all experimental thought. Yes, this is good. Really not understanding the function of a tail, I think, but I, it's yours to do with as you please. Oh, good answer. All right, fine. fine. We'll take the tails and also the, the mer abilities and also the shape shifting shit. And Done the English one, are you? Does that work for you? You seem contemplative. Mm, yeah. Do you guys have like a presence more, no, outside of this city? Like, are there mer people just kind of like all over the ocean? There are there are mer civilizations elsewhere. Uh, we so do not if, stay. Go if ahead. If we ran into some trouble somewhere, you know, way out there, and maybe like we needed some help, you guys would probably come in for us after we saved you, right? Like if we if we were in a pinch somewhere down the road, we found ourselves in the ocean, and we needed you know some backup, we could potentially call on some mer people to hook us up. Uh, well. Communication is a possible issue, but I would assume that if you happened to find some way to 
either if there was a mer person there or uh, find some reliable way to contact us that I suppose that would be uh, agreeable. Uh, also, uh, our ultimate goal here is the restoration of our very powerful uh, civilization to its full, full might, and that could also very well come with some more rewards as we can offer more. Okay. Yeah, okay. I, I feel like I'm pretty pretty down for this agreement. We get mer powers, shape shifting powers, and basically. We'd love to be a duke just... of the ocean. Oh yeah, could we all be duke dukes? Of the ocean, you shall be. Duke for dukes. We can. Yes. You can guarantee all yes. this. I can guarantee Great. all of it. In fact, who are you? I, if you, I. <laughs> My name is uh, Zord, and I am a former general of the Royal Forces, and now leader of the Resistance. Oh, you're the lead? Okay, cool. Uh, oh, yes. okay. All, right. all right. So we all get to be dukes, we get the powers, Duke. and just sort of like undying allegiance from the Mer people, if we pull this off. Uh, yes, I can't speak for every Mer person, uh, but... But all those other things, yes, and generally a good will toward you, yes. All right, I, I can. I, I feel like I can get on board with that. I, I, Brahms, Skipjack, how you guys feeling? Yeah, I, I could live with this. It's more than I think we really wanted in the first place, so I'm okay with it. Excellent. If you'll uh, if you'll follow me, we will uh, imbue you with these magical powers, and I think. Uh, we should begin training immediately because, as we stand, more and more energy is radiating away. What's uh, it gonna hurt? I don't know. I've never did, done it before. All right. And uh, with that, he walks into uh, this, uh, what looks like kind of a blacked out bottom right room, uh, which I don't know if you can see is kind of hard, but it has a sword emblem on top of it. Uh, and you uh, mm -hmm. swim into this room. Uh, and it is kind of like a what's a reasonable thing okay so it's just it's just like a white room with kind of like a grid layout it looks like if you ever play street fighter it looks like the training room or the imaginarium from community or anything along those Ooh. lines uh, just like a, a blank room of potential uh, and he <laughs> says uh, just like my mind this... <laughs> exactly uh, this is our battle room, and, uh, I think it important that the first thing we do is find out exactly what you're capable of, uh, because we don't have warriors here. We have many technicians and researchers, but we don't have anyone to actually fight, and I need to see what you can do. Uh, first, Wait, he snaps so his fingers. you're leading a resistance of nerds and no one, and children, and no one to fight. And you're trying to overthrow a city. That is the challenge we face, yes. The okay. radiation seems to affect aggressive individuals much more. So this is what Are you we a have. big nerd? Are you like the big nerd? I am I am a big uh, battle nerd, but yes, a nerd, nonetheless. I respect it. Mm. I respect it. Can you give me just like I a very like so. brief rundown of what the conflict like why are you guys fighting so our magical energy source uh <laughs> i'm just gonna give you the dm overview so uh the magical <laughs> energy source that this <laughs> the magical energy source that this uh society has used for a very long time has started to decay uh particularly the like containment thing that they made uh has started to decay and so this raw power like a nuclear reactor is radiating energy away uh kind of like an open chernobyl uh and so it is having negative effects on the people and uh plants and animals and structures around it particularly uh the aggressive ones so all the enforcers and the like big guard and dolphin that you fought last time all examples of that the king mm. is going the king is going slowly more and more insane and so feeding all of this into just a downward societal spiral uh and this group is trying to find a way to either reestablish their power source or at the very least contain it uh 
so that it cannot uh, destroy what's left. So the baddies are like basically like zombified by this ra radiation. They, there's not like a like a, a I ideological conflict happening here. It's just that like some of these Correct. guys have have smooth brain from the radiation, and so they just don't know what's going on. Yes, we were smooth brain. very peaceful before this. It is it is purely the the magical power that is doing this. Got it. Okay. Cool. All right, let's, yes. let's do this. All right. <laughs> um, he snaps his fingers and a uh, uh, a person with like a equi underwater equivalent of a lab coat uh, swims in um, <laughs> and sprinkles some like what looks like fish food almost uh, over you and kind of mutters some incantations. Uh, and you all kind of slowly uh, experience the morphing of your lower halves into... Uh, tails as your legs stick together and start to fuse. Oh. They ah. grow My slightly ass. wider. Your feet extend and your toes web together as they become oh. the end of a fin. And finally, ah. when the transformation is complete, you feel yourself neutrally buoyant and very easily able to slip through the water. I'm going to need to get new headshots. <laughs> um... Skip's gonna immediately like. I feel like Skip's just gonna immediately be so thrown off. He's gonna like flip his tail and just like immediately <laughs> propel himself backwards into a wall or something. Oh, d from the hips, not uh. Don't swim from the tail. Swim from your hips. There you go. You'll get it. You're a capable young elf. <laughs> Nomeo and Bromps, do you guys get the hang of this, or? Uh, this is kind of, I did a movie that I had to, like, have sort of, like, my lower half. I was, like, paraplegic, and I just, like, couldn't really move my lower half, so I'm pretty much used to only having upper body. Uh, I'm sort of, like, wiggling my lower half. What was I'm, the I'm name feeling... of that movie? Uh, gosh, I, that's, it was straight to DVD, honestly. I didn't even, I, I don't even remember. My agent got was it for it me. My left Nomeo? That's, I think that's what it was. Yeah, my left no me out. It's pretty that's good. It, you saw that? God, I didn't think anybody yeah. saw that. I didn't see a penny from that. I didn't see. They said that it. They that's said that you have it a bombed. horrible we agent. Even then. sell it to the airlines. It, it plays in dentist offices a lot. Mmm. Yeah, I don't go to those. <laughs> and I'm known as Stumpy from where I come from. I just kind of float around. Really, don't have a lot of physical capability of, of swimming. So this is much better. It's an improvement and I like it. Excellent. Well, I'm glad to hear it. You'll get the hang of it, no problem. Um, now, it's time for us to fight. And uh, Zord uh -huh. claps his hands and can you hit, yeah, fight one. Uh, and the room begins to transform into what looks like uh, just kind of an open underwater area. Uh, you see mm -hmm. Uh, around you, this uh, on the bottom right, you'll see the kind of map of the area. Uh, you guys are placed at the bottom, looking up toward that arch, and Zord is standing uh, in the middle of the arch with his arms crossed. And he says, uh, Like you pointed out, all of the most powerful and aggressive members of our society are fighting against us. So, you're going to need to beat most of them. Uh, he snaps his fingers once more, and a barracuda and a swordfish swim up next to him. And he okay. says, uh, So, we're going to do this until you can beat me handily. Uh, <laughs> and with that, we're going to go ahead and launch right into our battle. Um, we are using a slightly new system. Uh, guys, are you, are you ready to just go for it? Do you want another refresher, or... Um, I pulled, I'm pulling up my, my rule card and my, my person card. Maybe you just give a quick run to, I think it's just Aiden and Kevin in the chat. So maybe just okay, give them a quick sweet. rundown as to how yeah. that uh, is working now. <laughs> Two or 200,000, it's all the same. Um, so, uh, we're using a new inventive system. Uh, and basically, uh, if you guys are in the Discord or on the Discord, you can check out the D&D page and it will have this uh, master rules sheet there for you to look at. But the basic idea is that instead of rolling for things like, uh, you know, your uh, attack against somebody's AC 
and uh, rolling for damage. We're simplifying it to every action has a certain percentage to succeed, uh, depending on how good your character is at that action. So, for example, if I ever say practiced action, that means that that action is a straight up two thirds chance. Uh, the idea is that it speeds up the process. So rather than adding a bunch of numbers together, we can uh, say, I swing my sword, roll and say it hit or it didn't, and then move immediately on to the next thing. Because there's a few mechanics in here uh, that reward fast actions, uh, namely the timer, which we'll see come up in a second, uh, and then different ways to kind of multiply damage based on that. So that's a general overview. I expect we'll probably stumble through this the first few times, but I think we're going to get the hang of it. So yeah. Cool. Cool. Let's have fun. So remind me again. So do we have to mm -hmm. pick numbers um, oh, like you yes. did the last few rounds? Yeah, you're right. Uh, let's pick the success and fail numbers for the dice. So one for the d4 and two for the six and 12. Um, do we pick our own or do we pick ones together? Um, just pick them together because it's too many to keep track of. Yeah. It's... Okay. If anyone's do got, feels. Do you want to do one for the D4 since one is like a fail? Or wait, no. One yeah. would be good, right? In this case? Uh, well, it depends on which one you're rolling. If you That's are rolling right. the 75% chance, then you want to hit that one number. Uh, okay. If you're rolling the 25%, then you. Or excuse me, vice versa. But. Gotcha. Yeah, we, uh, use, we only use one? three dice. Yeah, one's good. One for the okay. D four, and then yeah, I like that. How about Rocky? You said five. So how about we do one and five for the D six, so that we just same numbers. I like it. Cool with me. Okay. Cool. And the D twelve, same one and five. Oh, D twelve. Um, sure. Why not? One and so. five. Yeah, just make it simple. Yeah. Cool. All right. So one, and then one and five. Um. All right. I think uh, without further ado, um, let's just uh, go ahead and start that battle timer when you're ready, and we are doing this open initiative style. All right, okay. Zord is going to swim straight for Skip and swing his trident. He gets um, Skip. three damage. Oh, shit. Ah, fuck. Okay. Um, Skip is going to block, on. and wait, then... Wait, wait. Oh. wait for the... Sorry. My bad. Um, mark your damage, the timer. and then... I freaked out. I, I know. Uh, oh, so the first person to act, I guess we're going to stumble through it. Uh, the first person to act controls the turn. So okay. in that case, uh -huh. when I'm your enemy and I act, uh, I've used my turn for that turn. So okay. I've, uh, even if it only takes me 10 seconds, you can then uh, wait for the timer to play out because I can't do anything else for that remainder. Okay. I don't know if that's confusing Great. or not, but... Uh, no, it's fine. Um, quick question. I picked up a yes. I picked up a trident in the last round. Can I use? It should be on. Yeah. Go ahead. Oh, it's on there. Oh, okay. I see it. Cool. Um, sorry. Um, I'm actually going to use my dagger then, since he like came up close to me. I am going okay, to cool. just straight up stab him. Okay. And I am going to roll cool. with this, and it's with good odds, so I'm trying to hit anything but the one or the five. Huh. Okay, so I got a four. So that's okay. gonna do it. Yep. And then it's two damage. Cool. Noted. And right. Skip is just gonna go, ow! Think quicker. Uh, as he, like, pulls the trident out of his stomach and backs away to a more defensive ah! uh, stance. Uh, uh, I throw my hand axe. <laughs> Okay, cool. Make a roll. Uh, the delay right. makes it hard. This is, I know, right? And this is a D6. Just making sure. Yep. Or what is it? Yep. Oh, God. It's a two. Uh, yeah, you're okay, good. So. Catch him for four, right? Yeah. Okay. Fuck. Cool. Uh, uh, nice toss. <laughs> I'm going to do a taunt. So that's my okay. D4 with good odds, so I just need to not roll a one. And I got a four. Cool. So taunt him, and then uh, the effect that that's going to have is I believe it will 
boost the likelihood of the next attack against him, correct? Uh, I next, it's a, I think it, uh, debuffs their next attack. Oh, okay, cool. Um, awesome. So, go ahead and taunt him. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm gonna do, uh, just flick him off. <laughs> yeah, baby. The A classic. classic. The classic. I don't know what that means, but I don't like it. Hold on. So, uh, with these timers, yes. sorry, just to clarify. Yeah. Can okay. anyone go at any time, like when the timer restarts, or is it does it go in a turn system? So everybody, everybody in the scene needs to act before anybody can go again. So, uh, for example, now that you've all gone, I can attack anyone. Again. But anyone uh, could attack again if we were quicker yeah. than you. Okay. Correct. And then uh, the idea of the twenty-second intervals is that if uh, if you if all three of you or two of you are able to act within the 20 seconds, uh, it will boost your damage. I don't think I said oh, that. Oh, cool. Years, so. so if we go super, yeah. super quick, we can just, like, fuck you up. Exactly. Yeah. Cool. And then you exactly. can only use... Like, you can't use all your good stuff in a row. Like, once you use a practice skill, do you have to use a novice skill? Or can you just keep using your practice skills? So you can use... Uh, any other skill, you can use the same skill, but at a lower level. Uh, it'll have a cooldown next to it. Um, mm. All the practice skills have a cooldown of two. So for example, okay. if you use a practice skill, you can't use it at the same level again for two turns. Got it. Okay. But you could roll so... it at a novice. Lower. Cool. Okay. Sorry, I was yeah. just trying to clarify. No, okay. I'll a, let this I timer think, yeah. run out and then we can... Yeah, yeah. hit it. Okay. Um, Skipjack is gonna throw a trident at you. <laughs> okay. And I'm gonna roll, and I got a one. All right. Uh, guess what though? I'm gonna dodge. Fuck. And I succeed. So I dodge your trident. God damn it. Uh, and he's good. I'm gonna throw my trident, and I also got a one. <laughs> Shit! <laughs> he dodges, and then it catches him in the ah. Damn. <laughs> uh, okay, sweet. Three damage, right? Uh, yes, I think so. Where do I see how much damage it does? Uh, it should be. Have oh, any you know damage what? for me? Yeah, I didn't mark it. That's my bad. But it is three damage. Okay, cool. Okay. Uh, cool. <clears throat> and it does wait. It does extra damage because it's against a sea creature now. If that's the one, if that's the perk you want to choose, yeah. Oh, I see. I see. Um, yeah, I think so. Okay, uh, so then it'll be five. Let's go. Great. Let's go. Uh, Zord grunts, and, uh, he lets out, uh, a, like, a screech-like sound. Um, and you guys are all Are we supposed to, to be roll. killing you, or...? <laughs> it's a spar. Uh, roll whatever your constitution is trying to succeed on that throw. Failed. You should all have different levels. Failed. All right, you're I a, stunned. I got a one. Uh, I got a four, so I'm good. You are not stunned. Hold on, my dice fell. Oh. You're good. How do you know I if you're four. rolling with good odds or bad odds? Uh, so on your specific sheets, it'll say next to your constitution, uh, it'll have a shape with a color, and that'll tell you which... Oh. Uh, level you're rolling at. Okay, gotcha. so if it's if it's a red triangle, that means I'm rolling my D4 with, with bad, bad odds. odds. Yes. Got it. Okay, wait, so then I failed that, because I got a 4 and not a 1. Okay, cool, so you're stunned. Okay. <laughs> Alright, uh, so skip me. Anomio. You guys are both stunned. Sorry, go ahead. Uh, Zord is then going to point at the both of you uh, and say something in some kind of mer language, and the barracuda is going to speed at Skip first and bite no. him successfully for four damage, no, no. and then speed no. at Nobio second and uh, miss the bite on him. Excellent. I'd like to uh, have, swipe directly at the midsection left. of the barracuda with my coral axe. Do it. That's a two. 
Uh, I think that's a success. Yeah, and then uh, you roll uh, for your coral specifically. Uh, you'll roll yeah. again with the d6 with bad odds to see if that works. Got it. Four, so bad odds is it would have been five. You, I had to get yeah, five so you one, missed. Right? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, wait, did, yeah, I, I gotcha. did my taunt do anything? My my debuff uh, of that attack. Uh, I forgot about that. That's my bad. I'll add it on the next one though. Okay, cool. Um, if a character dies in this specific scenario, uh, we're gonna run this fight several times. I designed it to hopefully okay. defeat them the first few times. So it's just like okay. a fainting in Pokemon for now. Gotcha. Okay. Um, are, am I still stunned? Uh, you are not... Sorry, I need to gather myself here. I just processed a lot of information. You're fine. You're okay. Okay, uh, Skip is not still stunned. Uh, Nomeo oh. is no longer stunned. And you know what? Uh, the stun canceled out the debuff. Got it, okay. okay. Um, uh, Skipjack is yeah, gonna I, just freaking bow you down. Um, he's gonna okay. try and shoot you with his bow, and I got a two, so that's a succeed, and that's two damage to you. Okay, great. He catches an arrow in the shoulder. Fuck you! Um, <laughs> nothing, nothing clever. For my distraction, again, I don't know what that means, but I don't like it. Go ahead. For my distraction, I have a. a green plus sign and then it says next attack against enemy what does that mean that means uh if you succeed on the distract uh he's distracted and whoever's r uh, tries to attack him next will increase their roll level by one got it okay cool um i'm gonna do that do it i got a six that's good that works yeah um, okay, cool. I'm gonna distract the swordfish. Uh, okay, the swordfish is distracted. What are you doing to distract it? <laughs> Thanks, <Tommy>. Damn, <laughs> that finger does a lot of work. <laughs> does a lot of heavy lifting for Nomeo's, uh, character. <laughs> uh, the barracuda is gonna try to bite, uh, you again, Nomeo. Uh, and miss. Uh, right. and then it is gonna just try one more time to bite you because it's determined. Uh, and what a bitch. this again. This guy sucks. Uh, I'll let you know uh, what she about it. Bromps, I think it's you. Right. Um, I'd like to attack this swordfish. Um, I'd like to try and catch it in the mouth with my coral axe. And he gets Great. the buff yeah, because he's distracted. Yes, so increase Amen. the roll level by one. Okay, so I hit a four, meaning it'd be, it'd be proficient. Good. Uh, so is, is You're good. That, yeah. You're good. Go? Cool. Do I roll again for that? Um, okay, cool. You take a chunk out of the swordfish. Woo! Uh, but it is going to swing right back at you and get you mm -hmm. for four. Uh, and then it's going to oh. swing once again immediately and miss the second time. Um, Zord, however, is going to uh, swim directly at you, Bromps, and oh. grab you uh, and try to slam you against a rock. And he is going okay. to succeed. And you take three damage from that. Three damage. All right, cool. And are now pinned against a rock. Am it's I able to fight for now? Uh, oh. You can fight, but you gotta uh, you gotta roll a strength to escape whenever you want, and it is a new turn. Gotcha. So everybody's fresh now. I mean, everybody can act. Um, Skipjack's knife is done being cooled down, so I'm just gonna try and like whiff it at the fish that has Bromps pin, okay. and I got a two, so that hits and it's uh, two damage. Okay, fish is looking not good. I'd like to kick uh, Zord in the uh, Mer genitalia. Um, okay. <laughs> is it a strength? Is it a strength? In an attempt yeah. to escape. Is that a strength roll? Yeah. Okay. I love it. I'm rolling a D4. It hits a two. Uh, Good. Forget. Good? All right, cool. So he I, takes I, two I damage and lets you go. Uh, awesome. Cool. 
let's see. Um, however, in retaliation, I... Zord is going to... Oh, wait. Do you have a Son second attack? Bitch. I was going to say, could I? Or, oh. Um... oh, yes. You're right. Sorry, you're good. Because that was a that was an attempt to get out. So he doesn't take that damage. Gotcha. That's my bad. Like I said, little mistakes. All right, cool. Well, I'd like to sweep yes, you. Yes, Okay. Cool. That's a one. Oh. Uh, missed, right? Yeah, I guess so. Wait. Uh, what did you What did you roll it as? Uh, it was a sweep kick, so no weapon. But I mean, like, uh, how would that be? That was a D six. Oh, okay. So did I roll it? No, this, is a, was that... this is a perfect opportunity. So, uh, so in this circumstance, uh, if yeah. you want to do something like that. Uh, you'll have to use one of your character, one of your attributes to do it. Um, gotcha. So you can okay. roll it. I would say either strength or dexterity makes sense for both of those, or both of those make sure. sense for that. So you can pick gotcha. one. Gotcha. Okay, I'll roll a dexterity then, um, or I'll roll strength because I have a T four, and that is going to be a three. You got him. All right, Hell that yeah. he'll take two damage from. Not this <laughs> fool down. So I can murder uh, you in this scenario? I'm, I just want to make sure this is fine. I'd like to see you try. Awesome. This guy rules. <laughs> um, I think uh, I'll go. Can I go? Yeah. Yeah. I think it's, I think uh, it's free reign. Oh, okay, cool. Yep. Uh, I'm going to throw, throw, throw my trident again with novice skill, so I roll my d4. Um, and I got the one. Nice. Uh, so I'm going to throw my trident. The fish is the one with the lowest HP. How much does a fish have? Uh, which fish? The one near, near you? Uh, uh, yeah, has well, what six they, hit points. What do they both have? One has six and one has what? Four. Uh, I'm going to go for the one with four. With the trident okay. with, with extra damage because he's a fish. Great. And That's you got five, him, right? right? Yeah. Yeah. Swordfish is dead. Let's go. And. Let's and, go. Because you succeeded on a novice roll, you are now in flow, which means all of your cooldowns have reset. Everything Ooh. is bumped up one level, and you get a free second attack right now. Uh oh, whoa, okay. go! Uh, I'm gonna go Morning Star on the other fish. Okay. And I Let's got a four, go. which is good. Uh, yes. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah. Although you, you should have rolled that at the proficient level. Because uh, it bumps up one level, but either way you succeed. So I'm not going to make you re-roll since you just uh, succeeded. Oh. Okay, cool. Cool. But yeah, Barracuda takes uh, two damage. Excellent. And is now at four. Um, Zord is going is to try to throw. Uh, oh, Zord is going right now. Zord thought faster. <laughs> oh. Take take this dwarf, and he throws his net at you, huh? uh, and you are now you are now netted. Uh, and Ooh, me? then points. Yes, Bromps, you are now netted. Uh, and he points to you, and the Barracuda is going to swim over and uh, try to attack you uh, and hit you can I, for can I block? four damage. Uh, okay, ouch. No, because you're netted. Fine. Sorry. Your Friends, I'm blocked uh, by the internet to, of this net. He's going to try to okay. do it again. Oh, go ahead. But miss second time. All right, go ahead. So, Bromps, you took uh, four um, damage. I feel like I'm going to see... Four <laughs> yeah, okay. Uh, oh, sorry. <laughs> Thank you. So, Skip is going to pull his knife out of the fish that was killed near Bromps, because that got stuck in there, and I'm trying to stay, um, you know, canon. Huh? Um, and he's going to use his... Can I use my tail to just slap the doctor? Yeah. Like, because that... Do I, would I just use strength for that? Strength or Dex, I think, makes sense, whichever one you want. Okay, cool. They're the same, so for me. Cool. And I got a six, so I'm going to just slap you right across the face while I grab my knife out of the fish. Oh, I see you're learning to use the tail. He's going to take two damage from that. Oh, hm. sick. Let's go. Uh, and I believe that is everybody, right? So now it's a fresh turn, yeah. and we'll start on the top yeah. of this timer. Okay, cool. 
actually wait let's wait one more time around because somebody asked what that was let me explain it real fast so this yeah. uh this timer that you see this kind of rainbow colored thing is a 20 second timer five seconds in each section uh the goal is to if they can get multiple attacks in in one timer round they get damage boosts so it rewards fast thinking uh, that so we'll is start kind of hard with with the delay i am going to yeah. make that note now <laughs> True. totally um, no 100 percent uh, so and Wavy Lines, we all got tails because we got recruited to a special underground resistance uh, facility underwater, and they granted us tails, and we're learning how to fight with them right now. So we can help them take down their mad king. Yes. Um, so. so if I understand mm -hmm. correctly, and I'm going to try to explain it to Wavy, but maybe this is wrong. So yeah. we, we don't get unlimited attacks during the 20 seconds. We still each only get one turn per, or one attack per turn. Yeah. But if both of us, if multiple of us use our one attack during that turn, during one of these 20 second intervals, at the same, during the same 20 second interval, then we get the boost. Correct. Got Does it. it have to be all of us, or is it just like two of us or something? Like that? Uh, well, the there's the better. Yeah. So if it's only okay, two cool. people, you'll get a small damage boost. If you can all act, you'll get a big one. Cool. Gotcha. Let's start at the top of this so, guy. Does it? Does it or make not. sense strategically then? Sorry, I'm no, question. No, it's okay. I think this is okay. perfect yeah, time for going. Yeah, yeah, this is make more I, sense strategically yeah. for us to just like coordinate and like. Since, like, theoretically, there's no timer, well, right now, at least, there's no timer huh. total on how long we can take per turn, can we just be like, all right, let's wait for this timer to reset and then plan out our attack, and then when the timer resets, be like, all right, I'm going to do this, you do this, you do this, and then we just do them consecutively to hit the three? Uh, you can, yes. The the kind of uh, rebuttal to that that I will have as your, as your enemies in the fight yeah. is depending on, like... Like, if you have all yet to act, I might have crafted the enemy to have certain skills that can take advantage of that, so that if you are, mm. like, actively deciding to just, like, oh, let's just wait a second and talk this out, like, while you're talking, I might say, all right, I'm going to do these attacks to you right now to cool. kind of, okay. like, put some pressure you on up. you. Got yeah. It. Okay. Um, this cool. specific fight, though, I, I didn't really tailor this character for that, so, you know, maybe that's a good strat. Okay. Okay, um, cool. I think we should try and get two in this next one. Um, yes, definitely. I'll let someone else go first since I'm calling in. Okay, I'll go first. Uh, I'm going to do my Oh, wait, star. wait for it to start over. Oh, yes. All right, I'm doing my okay. morning star right now. And I got a one. Uh, oh, wait, no, I am, I am in flow, though. Let me roll a different dice, sorry. Yes, okay. I, I got the one again, which is still a fail. Yeah, you failed. Okay, okay you're out of flow. Okay. I'm gonna take my bow and just try and shoink you right through the neck, and okay. I got a five, so I miss. Oh no! <laughs> Good attempt. I'm gonna try and swipe my way out of the net with my hand axe. Uh, is that a strength thing? So I'm gonna roll four. That would, uh, that that would, would definitely a two? be a dex thing. That would be a dex thing for dex sure. Dex thing, understood. Yeah, waste. Okay, cool. So, gonna do it real quick. Oh, and it's a two. Uh, does that succeed? I think so, right? Yeah, our number was our number was one in five. Yeah, cool. Uh, but right, which so which one did you roll? Okay, you're out. Cool. I rolled a. Yeah. Um, Great. I'd like attack to. Uh, yeah, I'd like to attack Zord in the chest with my coral axe. Okay. Oh, that's a two. Got him. Um. <gasps> he takes a big old hit. I'm gonna swim Drop over and Where grab my trident. Oh. No, Zord has yet Zord has yet to go at oh, all. Oh, sorry. Sorry. And so when you guys act all in one turn, the enemy gets buffed as a as a retaliation. So in this circumstance, uh, it really didn't work out for you very well. Uh, okay. But mm. there will sometimes where it will work out. If you would yeah. if you would hit him with both of those attacks, you might have killed him. Um, so Zord is going to first uh, make that sound again, <laughs> and you all need to roll Constitution. Okay, that is... Tell me, tell me if you succeed or not. I got a three. I succeed. I got a two. I succeed. Okay. Uh, wait, you're so not we're turning constitution? Yes. 
Uh, I failed. Okay, <sighs> Nomeo is now stunned. Um, Zord is going to direct the Barracuda to bite at Nomeo. No. And he succeeds for four damage. Uh, Zord is no. going to direct the Barracuda to again bite at Nomeo. Bruh. Oh, uh, no! And he misses the second attack. Okay. Uh, but now, uh, Zord is going to... Actually, no, that's all he can do. Now it's a fresh turn. Okay. Skip's going to swim over, grab his trident, and try and throw it at Zord. Um, okay. And I'm rolling with bad odds, right, on my D12. I got a one. Sick. Okay, cool. Ooh. Word. Did you see in a risky nice. action? Yeah, because it's my trident, so it's risky. Um, yeah. And it's times three damage. Yeah. Because so it's you, against a sea creature. Fucking one shot him. Yeah, get out of my wow. house. Get out of my house. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> oh, and he, Jesus. And uh, ah. he falls over. Ah. Fainted. The room, uh, the room fizzles and resets as Zord uh, pulls the trident out of his chest and some magical healers rush over. Uh, okay. You are all healed with various potions and uh, creatures and whatnot. Uh, and Zord says, uh, <clears throat> very good. I certainly did not expect <laughs> that. I have to say, though, I was, in fact, taking it quite easy on you. Perhaps <laughs> if we went to get <laughs> uh, Skip is just full on, like, <laughs> 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 We all just watch as you do that for about ten seconds. Oh, oh, you were taking it easy. Okay, sure, bring it. Uh, one, uh, one quick thing I I forgot to mention. Uh, so Sydney, on that last turn, uh, you started Sydney. when uh, Skip. <laughs> sorry, Sydney, Skip, Skip. When you started on uh, that last turn, you started on the yellow of the timer. And so the reason it's yeah. separated into sections is so that uh, if if you guys want, you can just notice that you start on the yellow and the turn will last till the next yellow so that we don't have to wait till the top of each timer. Oh, uh, but that might okay. be too much to consider right now. That's a lot to, to think about. Yeah, so anyway. Take, taking uh, in a lot of new information. <laughs> yeah, 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 sorry. Let me know if it gets overwhelming. Uh, no, we're good. So Zord says, uh, <clears throat> all right, rematch. He snaps his fingers and the room goes back, uh, back to the thing. Mm -hmm. uh, I will uh, say that. Let's go to fight. Let's go to fight one again. I have some ideas. Okay. Okay. Uh, and then y'all ready? Mm -hmm. I have a quick question about taking damage again. So when, when I take yes. damage, like I, when I took four damage last time, that goes against my HP, right? What is my what's the difference Correct. between that and my armor class? Uh, so we did away with armor class. Oh, okay. um, basically, what replaces that is your block and dodge, which will roll on reaction. So, like if I say I you know throw my trident at you, and you're like I want to try to dodge this because it's important to dodge it right now, uh, then you can then you can roll for that. I see. Okay, cool. So and then, when I take damage, yeah. I'm just subtracting it from my total HP. And no, no, no. We have on, the we have the red bar HPs now oh, on our yes, um, yes, yes, on our right. on our cards. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. And each and one then of those a, little bars is one HP. Yeah, one of those little red things. Yeah. Got yeah. it. And then I have a question about blocking and dodging because you're, it says yeah. in the card to do it in real time, but yeah. Um, Delaying like you're effect. rolling, you're rolling and saying that it hits before we yeah. even have a chance to be like, I try and block. So I or think, do, or I think, do you just try after you roll? I think you can try it after you roll. I think, okay. I think maybe the best way to think about that is just like, um, meaning I think in real time in that context should mean like, even if you've already acted that round, you can mm -hmm. still, if someone does something and hits you, you can still in real time say, I block. So it's like, maybe okay. used any time is, is fine. Okay, cool. Yeah, but they also have cooldowns. Got it. Yeah, I saw. It's like three turns, so uh -huh. kind of gnarly. Yeah. Balance adjustments right. will be made. As... Alright, ready? Yeah, we're figuring it out. We're having fun. Yeah, figuring it out. 
Uh, for delay's sake, I'm going to say you guys can take the first turn on the top of the timer. Okay. And Zord will okay. retaliate. Uh, okay, let me reintroduce the timer, and we'll go maybe on the next okay. one. Yeah. Okay, well, let's use this time to plan. I'm going to taunt immediately out of the gate. Okay, and then I'm going to just try and risky action it with the trident again, because the damage is so good. Then I'll just actually, go for a gonna, clean hit with an action. Third. All right. I'm okay. Gonna, I, I do a trident. I miss. Okay, I do a trident <laughs> as well, and I miss. I kind of dive toward Zord with a hand axe and try and hit him in the neck with it. Uh, four. So I hit. hit. <laughs> oh, there we yeah, go. Yeah, baby. Good shit. Let's go. Cool. Times three damage since you all acted, even though you didn't hit. Yeah, baby. Let's go. Okay. Oh, that's, now he's here. All right, great. Uh, Zord is going to, however, now uh, do that sound again. Um, but oh. he is buffed by your multi-attack, so you are all rolling your constitution one level lower. Oh, God, shit. So okay. Buff. It's not great. Oh, I got a one. Let's go. <laughs> Damn it. Um, I need to roll my d12, apparently, because mine is so uh, bad. Uh, uh. Uh, I rolled a three, but one level lower. What do you mean by that? Sorry. So your constitution bronzed, I think, uh, is it a blue triangle or a green square? It's a green square. Okay, so you roll it at a red triangle, which means you're trying to hit a one, which means you missed. Gotcha. Uh, and I rolled my risky D12, um, uh -huh. but I got a one, so I'm chilling, All right. I think, right? Let's go. <laughs> confident. I was like, odds are in my favor. Alright, Bronx is the only one stunned. Uh, but Zord has a second attack as well. So Zord is going to uh, try and throw his, uh, or swim and thrust his trident into Bronx. Uh, and he is going yeah, yeah. to... Oh, oh my god. He's going to miss. That sucks. What a cock. He's going to... Sick. Damn it! Uh, and then he's going to point <laughs> at the both of you, Skip and Nomeo, and the Barracuda is going to try to bite Skip. Uh, succeed once for four damage. Can I dodge? Succeed... Can I try and dodge? Yeah, yeah, you can dodge that first one. Okay, 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 okay. Um, let's go. I dodge successfully. All right. You dodge the first one. Uh, the second one yeah. also succeeds. Oh, oh well then, fuck. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, uh, and since the second one was rolled at the novice attack, uh, the Barracuda resets and gets to go again. And what? now attacks you once more, Skip. Okay, uh, well then I'm gonna try and block. Okay. All right, you try to block that one. Um, and I, it does it. Yeah, I got a six, so that works. Okay. Because it wasn't cool. a one or a five. Yeah. Correct. You've only taken- So Skip's uh, just gonna, so you... Skip's just gonna like Great. throw up his forearms. You block that one, but guess what? He gets one more. Oh, uh, I fucking God. hate this fish. I'm gonna, God, I'm gonna turn this fish that. into a fucking skewer. You only okay, take well, four Skip damage. Is, okay, Skip is like pissed, and he's literally just gonna try and fucking like dagger this thing in the eye. Um, cause fuck your nonsense. And I make it, I got a three, so. Okay. Uh, Am I still stunned? Uh, Skip is just on, like yeah, straight. Like one handed dagger in the other, just into the eye. Just like, <laughs> fuck your nonsense. Uh, okay, so the attack that you just did, uh, normally yeah. you wouldn't get because you already acted this turn, but you succeeded on your block and your dodge, and both of those get you free attacks, so you actually get one more as well. Oh, okay. Well, then I'm going um, <laughs> to take out my pistol that I haven't used yet, which is a novice skill. Even though it's underwater, huh. and I know that that physics doesn't work, but I'm going to try yeah, well, and shoot this know. fish in the head. <laughs> oh, my God. Uh -huh. You enter. So literally you enter just flow. Take, out, take out my Go pistol ahead. and just literally, like, on the other side of it, just... <laughs> Kind of spins that, you. Does, that does so the the dagger did two damage and the pistol did three. Okay. <laughs> uh, five damage it, to that fish. Fish is not looking good, but it's not quite dead. Can we get uh, an HP check on our enemies right now? 
Uh, yeah, Zord is about half, Barracuda is two, and Swordfish is full. Okay. okay. Um, um, one other Swordfish, hold on. About... Oh, oh, yeah, yeah go, go ahead. ahead. Uh, I had a question about my distract move. Um, okay. it, it, get, it raises roll level of next action. Is that referring to my a- next action on the next turn, or is it like if I hit it in the first part of our turn, can then, like, let's say I hit mine and then Sydney takes huh? her move, it, does these, her... Uh, attack have uh, yeah, good raised question. level? So, it's whatever the next attack is. So, if if there were five enemies and you distracted one of them, uh, whatever the next attack against that enemy is, whether it's immediately after you or two rounds later, gets advantage. Copy. Or gets the okay, boost. cool. Yeah. Uh, but the swordfish has to attack still, uh, and it's going to swim at Nomeo, and maybe oh. it'll get luckier this time. Uh, misses the first attack, son of a bitch. Right. Misses the second attack, oh, son of a bitch. Let's go, no, no. Zord is looking go. like let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, is that Skip is, that is that just doing that body goes? rolls underwater. Yeah, we're fresh. We're fresh. All right, I'm gonna go with my Morning Star on the weaker of the two fish. Okay. Uh, and I got a two, so that hits for two okay, damage. It's dead. Let's it's go. dead? Let's go. Two enemies left. Um, I'm going to try risky move it with the trident again on Zord, and I got a 10, so that misses. Okay. Damn you, let me show you how it's done. He throws his oh. trident at you. <laughs> uh, and did he succeed? He did succeed. I'm going to uh, try and dodge. No, I'm trying to uh, dodge. And I got cool a down. 1. You, you can't, can't wait, what? cool down. No, yeah, I was in flow, so after. everything reset. Oh, I was in flow, everything right. reset. Uh, oh, shit! That's right. <laughs> I'm learning your system. rules. <laughs> so it's getting on in the game. Rules, and Damn. I got a dodge, so I am perfect. Sweet. Oh, All right, shit. you got a free attack right now. Because you dodged. Let's go. I get a free um, attack? What I didn't, oh, I'm just... Yeah, what I didn't oh. clarify... Hold on, sorry. What I didn't clarify last time, though, is that it's a specifically a dex attack on your dodge, so it's not your weapons. I let it... Whatever, last time, but... But my my dodge is a is a oh. proficient triangle, so it's the blue right. triangle, so I was just rolling uh, that, right? Yes, and the dodge succeeds, uh, but then yeah. your, your follow-up free attack from dodge has to be dex-based. That's beautiful because I'm gonna I'm gonna catch his trident in midair and just try and whistle it right back at him. And the dex okay, is so easier for me than the trident. And I got a four, <laughs> so I'm just gonna whiff that right back at you. <laughs> he takes, and because uh, it's a trident, it does extra damage against the sea creature. <laughs> oh my goodness, yo, y'all are torching Not messing me. around. Not messing around. Not uh, expect this. And he throws the trident down. <laughs> um, am I still dazed, think... or am I like back to go? Good to go again. You are. You should be good to go by now. It only lasts one turn. Oh, beautiful, gorgeous, great! I'd like yeah, to like okay. throw my coral axe up and then like <laughs> whack it with my tail and like try and send that flying into the remaining sea <laughs> okay. creatures. Torso, is that a risky Sweet. move or is that is that just a, a D six? Uh, did you have you used both your axes yet? I've used um, I've used the hand axe and the coral axe. Yeah, in like previous in like previous. So parts, the yeah. the coral axe is like an add on to the hand axe. So it's the coral axe is any time that you swing your axe, you can roll that extra thing to see if the coral. Attaches. The effect stakes in. Okay, cool. So yeah. I'm just gonna throw my throw my axe up and whack it with my tail in the direction of the remaining sea creature, and that's a okay. two. So um, hits, I think. But then I roll I think- it again, and it's a six. As far as the coral effect goes, Did so coral right? coral misses, axe hits. Coral misses. Okay, gotcha. All right. And you're, cool. you're going for the fish, right? Yes, yeah. Right. Sweet. Has everybody, everybody's gone this round, right? Yeah. Yeah. Morning Star. Sydney died or used her. Wait, did Sydney attack? 
Yeah, yeah. I used, I threw my trike, or I cut my there and threw it back at him. Oh, wait, no, but that was your reaction attack, so yeah, you still that have your reaction. Right that wasn't an attack. Oh, I still have my real attack? Yeah. Love it. Yeah, um, I'm gonna try and, yeah, I'm gonna try and dagger, um, wait, quick question, sorry. Yeah. If, are we doing things that can, like, is this battle literally just, like, attack and, and there's no consequence of anything? Because I would yeah. love to do stuff in normal bat like in normal D&D &D battle where it's like, I want to, like, stab him through the tail and pin him to the ground. Like, yeah. I want to yeah. stab right. so hard that, like, he gets stuck. Is, can that stuff still room. work? <laughs> can that stuff still work, though, even with this, like, system? Oh, oh, okay, I see what you're saying. Um, yes, so I think the way... Question. So, like, for example, you'd want to stab him through the tail to and like him pin in place. him to yeah to pin him to the ground. Right. Okay, so I think maybe what uh, maybe what we do instead then is uh, you can uh, yeah just off the top of my head, let's say you trade off damage for that effect. So you can roll okay. it, and instead of doing damage, you'll have some kind of extra effect. Oh, okay. Um, sure. And I succeed. Okay. So I'm just gonna try uh, and pin him to the ground with my dagger. All right. Uh, yeah. You. you damn it! <laughs> pin yeah. him to the ground. Just right through the tit, right through the fin. Just stick him in the ground like a skewer. Cool. Uh, he's going to. Uh, he's going to try to stab you with uh, the trident. Since you're right there, uh, he's gonna get you for three. Can I try and block since that all restarted for me? Yeah. I got a six. Can. What's your? What, I got what's a six. So I'm. Oh, it's a. Oh, it's one out of three. It's the orange one. So I had to get a one or a five. So I don't. I right. don't do it. I guess. Yeah. All right. Yeah. You take three damage. Ah! Um, he's going to. Uh, he's going to snap his fingers, and the swordfish is going to swim over, and uh, and try to attack you, Skip. Uh, and it's okay. going to. First, go with this one and miss, and then second, go with that one. And oh my god, I have been rolling so Ooh. bad! That's really good for me because I only have three little bars left. <laughs> I want to beat you! <laughs> Zord is frustrated! <laughs> uh, but okay. I think it's Nomeo's the only one left. It's everyone's turn, yeah. Oh. Uh, it resets, right? We're back now, yeah? I think we're back. Uh, yeah, but I just... You just went, so it. now it's all of our turn. Okay, go for it. Yeah, right? call it fresh. Think, yeah. Okay, uh, I'm going to throw my... Wait, well, can I get an HP check one more time on bad guys? Uh, yeah, Zord is 13, Swordfish is 6. 6. Mm, okay, I'm going to throw my trident at the fish. The fish. And I miss... Can I try okay. and grab the, the fish's sword-like beak and then snap it on my knee in half? Yeah, make it a strength roll. Got it. That's a three. Does that count? Uh, what's your strength roll that? It's uh, blue, so that means... You're good. Oh, You're shit. good, baby. Cool. Great, yeah. so I grab the swordfish, and I grab its sword-like beak, and snap it on my knee in half. <laughs> oh. Oh. Uh, is that, can that right. thing oh. just not attack anymore? Oh. Oh. Um, that's a good question. That's a good question. Yeah, what does that mean? What did yeah. I do? Um, we're going to say, we're just going to say functionally it can still attack, but it took a big hit. Um, so... Yeah. It, let's say you like you like snap the, the end of its sword beak off, but it can still do its thing. <laughs> Skewer. Still pretty yeah. cool. I'm gonna try and cool. shoot that. Can try and shoot that fish underwater, baby. How much damage did that do? <laughs> uh, that only did two because it's just a strength move. Copy. So oh. they're down to uh, four. Yeah. 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 And I I missed my gun attack. Okay. Uh, now, let's see, how can I... And Zord has 13. What can I do? Yeah, Zord has 13. We gotta get, starts Zord, with 30. We gotta get Zord, baby. Yeah. Well, let's finish um, off this fish so that they only have one attack per turn. Okay, yeah. Zord is going to do the following. He is going to swim, uh... He's swim stuck to the at, ground. 
That's right, fuck. Um, all right, he's gonna try to strength check his way out of this uh, dagger. Uh, and god damn it, <laughs> he's not gonna do it. Um, so he's just gonna try to throw his net at Skip because he's mad at Skip uh, <laughs> and succeeds. So Skip is now ah! netted. Uh, and the swordfish is gonna be directed to come try and attack Skip twice and is going to uh, hit him once on a Ouch. novice action. So Skip takes four damage. Well, I'm dead. Ah, no. uh, yes! <laughs> And right, now, guys, uh, now yeah, sword is going to play, finally, and direct uh, the swordfish at Nomi. Huh? Um, the swordfish is now in flow, so the swordfish uh -oh. goes for one and gets you for four. Okay. Uh, and Rude. then goes for a second and gets you for four again. Oh, Rude. No. Fuck. And now we're fresh. Alright, I am going to... Use okay. Actually, oh my God. hey, what the fuck? Yes, yeah, I'm cheer for the Lord. All right, Brahms. Brahms, I have yeah, an idea yeah. here. I think you attack first. It. This this fish only has um four. Wait, he has four health left. Yeah. Okay. Actually, never mind. I'm gonna his way out of the knife while you're talking. He oh, gets it. He's out. Shit. Okay. Damn it. All right. I'm just gonna use my hypno stick on the fish. Okay. And I fail. No. I'm the going to try and use my coral axe on Zord. Uh, just kind of straighten the chest again. Okay. It's a six. I think you have to roll. I think you have to roll oh, at check, lower yeah. levels though, because they're both on cooldown. Right. So lower level from a D6 is uh, the red triangle. So D4 triangle. with bad odds. For bad odds. I hit a two, so that doesn't hit, huh? Nope. Ooh. Okay. Zord dodges. My turn. <laughs> he screeches one more time. Roll your constitution. Romeo, I'm scared. Rolling my constitution. Please. Nope. Right. I miss. L lower constitution than the normal or? Regular constitution. Regular constitution. Got it. Constitution states. I had a two. Uh, I think you're good. I am good. Okay. Nomeo is stunned. Uh, Zord snaps at Nomeo, and the swordfish goes back once more. Uh, but this is oh, gonna he's gonna be the end of this boy. one. Uh, and is gonna miss the first attack, Come and on. hit the second one for four. All right, end Nomeo of Nomeo jelly on rip. You could try to dodge or block if you want. Oh yes, you're right. You I'm gonna do that actually. Gun. I'm gonna block. Um, actually, I'm gonna dodge because that is the better odds. Cool. Um, Thank you very much. Let me, let me confirm that. Thanks, Curly Hey, thank you, Curly Whirly. All right, I block. I mean, I dodge. Sorry, I dodge. All right, sweet. Now you get a free dex attack. Okay. Go. Um, Go, man. And it's only I'm a four good. HP. <laughs> uh, I got five. Wait, we said five is bad. Fuck. Five yeah, now. you fail. Son you fail. Of a bitch. All right, can I attack <laughs> now? Am I good? Can I do something? Uh, we, yes, uh, you're good. Turn? Yeah, you're good. Here, I'd like to crack the swordfish right in the middle of the mouth with the coral axe and just try and split it down the center all the way down. Um, okay. Your cooldown uh, should be hit, fresh. I hit a five. <laughs> you miss. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> you cannot believe I hit a five. Whiff that one. Uh, uh, uh -huh. The swordfish is going to try to uh, gonna try to bite you. Uh, it misses its first attack. Uh, but okay. Zord is going to, uh, it misses its first attack. Zord is going to swim in, uh, swim straight fast at you, Bromps, uh, like he did last right. time, uh, and grab you and slam you against one of these rocks for three damage. Can I block? I can't block. Uh, can you can, block? you can dodge that. Dodge, uh, what did, it, what did this hit? Jesus Christ. Uh, I have a bad rolling system here. I had a two, so now that, that happens. AP does that shit. You miss. All right, you take three damage. Ouch. Um, and the swordfish is going to try to uh, attack Nomeo once more and succeed for four. I'm going to block. Okay. Oh, I guess. Okay. <laughs> what? <laughs> Let's go. All right, and you get a and strength attack? Strength attack. 
Uh, okay. Three, yes. Okay, let's go. Uh, uh, yeah. All right. It's yeah. super bloodied. Uh, oh, yeah, what do you do? What do you do? Um, I, like, kind of grab onto its face and just, like, thumbs into the eye holes. <laughs> <laughs> what an eye action tonight. <laughs> Uh, it squirms away from you just as you start to puncture its eyes, but it is now looking super bloodied. It took what? One more hit will definitely do it. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, and now we're fresh again. Okay. Um, I can't use. Do you want to take? Do you want to finish that fish off, Nomeo? Or? Uh, yes. I will try to finish off the fish with my Morning Star. And I got a one, which is a fail. Fuck. Son of a bitch. All right, well, I'm going to try and um, just jam my axe in Zord's ass like a hot dog between buns. Okay. Um, that's a one. Whew. That is a fail. It's a failure yeah. on my behalf. Doesn't feel so good to get unlucky, does it? Uh, and Zord, uh, Zord is going to oh. throw his trident at Nomeo. And succeed oh. for uh, three damage. Uh, and then Zord is going to swim back from you, Bromps, and snap once at you. Uh, Nomi, are you still alive? No, I'm he's dead. Uh, okay, uh, he's gonna swim back from you, Bromps, and like snap at you. And the uh, swordfish is gonna come in for. Oh wait, no, he's gonna roll it. This one uh, miss its first attack. Hit its second one for four. I don't know four, what you're Can I try blocking that or? Yes, I actually can. haven't got. All right, I'm gonna try and block. <gasps> yeah, uh, hit. I hit a three. No, I got you hit. Should have like. So I I missed that block. So I got minus okay. seven HP. So one, two, three, okay. four, five, six, seven. I have eight left. All right, Bromst. Uh, you and me left. Very Sword fun. Is at two HP. Um, We're I fresh. All right, cool. Uh, can I um, throw both my hand axes, one at the swordfish, one at uh, at Mr. Uh, Zord, or is that yes? Kind of but way? you're throwing them, yeah. uh, you're throwing them at novice because they're on cooldown. That's fair. Okay, so you have to right. hit the one. You have to hit the one on the D four. I hit the four on the D four. Damn it! He dodges. Uh, right. He is going to uh, throw his trident at you once more and miss the trident. Uh, and okay. then the swordfish is going to swim in. And the swordfish uh, is going to hit you. And it's going to hit you at a novice level. So you take four damage from that. And now okay. the swordfish is going to try to bite you or hit you again. And it hits All you right. again. Uh, no. for I try another to dodge that though. I hit a one on the D four. And what's your dodge level? Is it red? It's a red triangle. You dodge. Let's go. Oh, Ooh. All right. And there's yep. a you dodge that attack. Looks like there's, there's a flow state symbol in the dodge triangle for me, or is that something irrelevant? Um, is there? I don't is that, think uh, so. That might be cooldown symbol. Cool. That might be the cooldown. So, yep, I think you're yeah. right. Okay, cool. Uh, but so now you get a that. dex attack. Yeah. Whew. Great. Can I grab the swordfish and try and uh -huh. rip it in half with my bare hands? Yeah, yeah. Why not? Great. And that's a dex attack, normal dex. So as, yeah, as per the thing. Yeah. It's a one. <laughs> <laughs> Let me oh, no. And then he like slurp away. <laughs> It, yeah, you're not dexterous enough to pick its spine apart, uh, and it comes in yeah. for uh, it gets. What does it get? It gets uh, one more attack on you here, right. uh, and it is going to oh, miss. God. Great! Doesn't even matter that I got a one, so I dodged. We're fresh again. Attack. It's just cool. bringing you this swordfish and sword. All right, gonna cut this uh, swordfish in half with my coral axe. My dice went under my bed. It's a five! God damn it. <laughs> Zord throws his trident. Uh, Zord throws his trident at you. He yeah. misses with the trident. The swordfish comes in and tries to bite you. The swordfish hits you for four. Does that kill you? I am dead. Yes! Damn it. 
Zord is victorious. All right, so it's one one. We need a tiebreaker. This is my yeah. domain. <laughs> need a tiebreaker. Let's go. All right. Um, Killed by a the uh, fish. <laughs> the room fizzles back, and Zord says, uh, "Well done, even all around. I'll let you choose the final arena." Uh, and you guys can look at the other. Skip two comes back to, to life, and it's just like <gasps> blood gulch four on one. <gasps> <laughs> Rust, he's gonna try and snipers. spit. He's gonna try and spit at Zord, but it's underwater, <laughs> so the spit just kind of like fizzles, <laughs> and then like sits in the sits in the water. <laughs> All right, uh, T. These are these are our options for our arenas. We've got this kind of like scary mask Ooh. place. That's Ooh. We've That's got awesome. the, these three rocks. The three <laughs> rocks. Or we've got the one that we've been doing. I want yeah, mask, let's do face baby. place. Place. All right, face yeah. place. Face All place. Right, we're going to face right. place. Cool. Loading face place. <laughs> The room fizzles <laughs> okay. uh, to replicate an area of the uh, the Mer City that you were just in. You see this uh, this map that you see on the bottom right. Uh, you see this face that has fallen apart. Uh, some tentacles are coming out of it, uh, like an animal is beneath it, and the pillars are crumbling and look like they could fall from a slight touch or the right I mean, environmental mm. attacks, like a Mortal Kombat. Right move. It looks like the environment could ha could be interacted with in some Very capacity. Interesting. I, like that. Very interesting. I have a quick question about cooldowns again. Um, yeah. Do the cooldowns apply for all attacks of a specific level? Like, for example, if I were to use my Morning Star, which has a two-turn huh? cooldown because it's practice, uh, practiced, does that mean that yes. that cooldown also applies then? to distract like i can't use either of those for two, two turns or just the one that you use got it okay so i can use yeah. i can use two practice moves back to back so long as they're different moves yes <laughs> correct got and that it. oh, it's a two cooldown because yeah because then you can you could use both your practice attacks but then for at least one turn you'll have to take a risk of some kind got it okay Cool. All right, we ready? Yes. Yeah. Do we know who our enemies are in this? It's the or same, same ones. Same yeah. ones. Okay. It's Zord so and the two fifty. We got yeah. Zord at, at how, what does he start at? Thirteen. Thirty. Thirty. He starts at thirty. Thirty. Yep. What? what? Okay. I do not remember that. And then okay. Zord is at. 30 what is each of the fish? Ten. Okay. Ten. Okay. Okay. Holy shit! I did not know he started at thirty. Okay. okay. Cool. Uh, alright, alright, alright. I think I'm ready. Cool. So, Skipjack is immediately gonna whistle down to the swimming beast, because I can speak with swimming beasts, and he's gonna okay. be like, uh, can you do anything? Uh, like, perhaps reach up and grab enemies? <laughs> uh, the, uh... That's my turn. The, yeah, yeah, the beast says, uh, yes, yes I can, <laughs> Do what should I grab for you? Uh, if you want to because try to I'm convince him, roll. To you and I'm speaking. Roll a charisma. <laughs> Rolling a oh. charisma. Uh, yeah. And oh, it's a two. So uh, I'm gonna just go ahead and say uh, because I'm the only one who can speak to you right now, and I'm the only one who could understand you if you were ever in pain. Oh. Fair enough. <laughs> if they come <laughs> near, I'll grab them. And your enemies don't yeah, notice. Yeah. Cool. And I'm gonna say it's it's water. two fish and a douchebag in a lab coat that he says is the underwater equivalent of a lab coat, so whatever that <laughs> is. You got it. <laughs> All right. Uh, we're going to say that uh, you guys, the, the three of you, are started by this top left pillar, and Zord is by the... Zord and the two fish are at the bottom pillar. Got it. Um, Zord is going okay. to snap uh, and instruct the Barracuda to swim around above the face to try and flank you on the right. Uh, but the tentacles are going to... Oh, they don't grab the... They miss. They try oh, to grab it, but they slip through, uh, and the Barracuda is going to attack uh, Nomeo first and succeed for four damage. Well, not so fast, because Nomeo is going to dodge. Okay. <laughs> and... He sure is. And he's going to not be able to do that, unfortunately. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> 
No meter takes four damage. The Barracuda is going to swim Jesus through Christ. and try to bite Skip and miss on Skip. Yeah. Um, do we get reactionary attacks or anything? Like. Uh, that's kind of what your block dodge is. Got it. Okay. Um, but now it's now it's there for you, and now it can't attack for the rest of the turn. Cool. But I already used my turn to talk to the tentacles, so I'm I'm out until Bromst and Zord go. Uh, yeah. I feel like no, that yeah, that counts because you're using an environmental thing. Yeah. All right. Okay. okay. I'm gonna go cool. if that is okay with everybody. Uh huh. Uh, sure. I'm gonna try to use my hypno stick. Uh, yeah, baby. On the, uh, actually on Zord. I'm gonna use it on Zord. Cool. I like this tactic. Uh, yeah. And I fail. Oh, <laughs> so, <God>. Damn. <laughs> well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna jump up and try and plant my hand axe in his neck. Can I also enter rage? I'm still, I'm still new to rage. Yeah. Uh, all right, cool. So I'm gonna enter rage and try and plant a, an axe in his neck. Um, Sweet. So, you'll roll your axe at the blue triangle because it boosts all your levels, uh, and cool. it will. If you are successful, you'll do six damage. Great. Oh. I hit a one. God damn it! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> what kind of just lying anymore? Why can't I just lie? Oh, man, I <laughs> god damn it! <laughs> you missed. <laughs> You miss, uh, and Zord is just gonna try to punch you in the stomach, Bromps. Um, <laughs> uh, although he's that. gonna miss too. Okay, cool. We're all missing. We really need it. Uh, Let's just restart. The Let's fish, just. The sword is the last one to act. No, you're. I don't think you're out of rage. Hold on, let me look at your thing. This real fast. fucking fish. What does it say next to next to your rage? Auto enter flow, disable items and abilities till refresh. Okay, yeah, yeah. So, no, you're still, uh, you're in rage for, oh, I didn't put how many turns. Uh, I think call it... It's usually like a minute in normal D&D. &D. Yeah, 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 yeah. Call it... Which is, um, which is ten rounds of combat, but that's whatever you want to... Call it three turns. Three turns? You're All right, I'm going to Photoshop that in yeah. there later. All right, three turns. And four. cooldown will start when rage ends. Gotcha. Okay, so that was one turn. Huh. Uh, cool. The swordfish is going to try to attack you, Bromst. Uh, it hits you once for four. You're trying to block. And uh, nope, uh, you can't because uh, your abilities uh, are not available when you're in rage. No, no. That's the cost of rage. Um, cost of rage. Uh, it's going to try again and miss the second one, so you take four damage. And now we're fresh. Took four damage. Okay. Um, yeah. Skipjack is going to try and throw a trident at uh, Zord. And okay. he is going to make it. Let's go. Got a five, and I needed that very badly. So that's plus nice. damage against the sea creature. So thank God. It's five. <sighs> that yeah. also puts Takes you in flow, right? Yes. What? You're also yeah, in because flow it, now you, because you hit that. Oh, because it was risky. Yeah. And it's triple and it damage, times, actually. Yeah, it was times uh, three damage. So how much do I kill you for? <laughs> so you take half of his HP right away. Okay, Whoa. fuck me up. Um, okay, and then I'm just gonna go straight into like another into a bow attack then. Um, uh, and you only get the and... second attack from the novice one. The triple damage is the boost on. Oh, boost. okay, that's fine. So I just roll this at a novice level. Uh, no, you only get one attack. Oh, but I'm in. Yeah, oh, I'm in flow. Got damage. it. Got it. So it was wait, just the that, times three damage. Yeah. Who got damaged in that one? Uh, Zord did. He took 15. Zord? So it he was, 15. wait, so it was damage to a sea creature and then times three. So it was like double, yeah. double damage. Hell yeah. yeah. Okay, let's go. That was big. Good job, Seth. So Zord has 15 now. Whew. Yeah. All right. Or, that um, hurt. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try my trident, I guess, since that worked out so well for Sid. <laughs> and I'm going to miss, of course. Okay. Very cool. Can I, can I, can I full turn here? <laughs> yeah, do it. Great. I'm gonna that try and try. And, yeah, yeah, I'm gonna try and bisect Zord at the tail with the with my coral axe. I like um, that. Great. Yeah, or just hold it the blue triangle. That's a two. You got him. Okay. Right. Uh, 
Shit. Sweet. So do I literally bisect him? Or... <laughs> Almost, because guess what? You acted within the same timer turn, so it's double. Uh, it's one point five damage, since it was two okay. of you, and you're still enraged, so it's six plus three, so nine. So now oh he's at four. <laughs> so you okay. almost bisect him. Yeah. You All cut, right. cut his tail. Just like, oh, damn. Very good. <laughs> um, <laughs> that shit hurt. Okay. Now he is going to uh, get to retaliate, though. And uh, he right. is going to make that screeching sound at all of you oh. uh, and roll your constitution minus one level. Since he nice buffed so. oh, That's God. red triangle. Red triangle? Yeah. Yeah. I hit a four. I got a three. I'm screeched. Okay. I got screeched. Oh, I got a one on Risky. I'm good. Yes. No, what? All right. <laughs> yes, Nomeo. Oh, Nomeo. Does that, does that um, yeah. also put me into flow? Because I... Or is that only for attacks? No, it's just a check. Yeah, it's only a check. So it's not being for attacks. Okay. Um, okay, so Skip and Bromster are stunned. Uh, huh? Zord is going to throw his trident at Skip. Uh, and clock you for, let's see, uh, it? oh, right, just to add to the roll. Um, ooh, ooh, ooh. he's gonna hit you for eight damage. That's cool, um, I'm at a, I'm at a cool two now. Sweet. <laughs> uh, and then, uh, he's going to snap, uh, the Barracuda to come at you, Bromst, uh, huh? who's going to try and Is bite you. Is my octopus friend helping me at all? Um, yeah, you know what? You're right. Uh, your octopus friend tries to grab the barracuda before, thank you, uh, before he can bite, and he grabs him. So the barracuda oh. cannot bite. Let's go. Um, the swordfish, Zord notices this okay. and sends the swordfish in in his place, uh, but does not send him over the tentacles, and the swordfish is going to... Uh, getcha for four. Uh, me? Four? And then try to try to get you one more time and gets you again. So eight. And now we're fresh. Dude, double attacks. How, who is near the, the bottom pillar right now? Uh, Zord and the Swordfish and Bromst. I have three HP left. <laughs> is there a way for me to push that pillar where it only hits Zord and the fish and not Bromst? Uh,. Yeah, I think. Yes, but let's say it depends on your roll. So let's make like a a dex roll for you to kind of knock that pillar. Okay. Mm. Yeah, and I okay. guess. Um, hmm, how do you do this? Ooh, let's do this. Roll roll your dex twice. First one is to see if you succeed in pushing it over. Second one is to see if you succeed in dodging Bronx. So if you succeed on the first and not the second, you'll hit all of them. If you succeed on both, you'll get just the ones you're looking for. Copy. And you can roll Bronx, them at the How much HP do you have right now? I have three HP. How much damage is this going to do if I hit it? Oh man, Great it's question. a pillar, so I was going to say four. <laughs> you're going to kill me a little extra. I can't risk that. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna. Um, Thanks, friend. I'm going to no. do my. Uh, Maybe distract. distract. I'm gonna do a distract here. Okay. And I fail again, Bruh. <laughs> I haven't oh, no. hit anything in like yeah. four turns. Uh, Am I still stunned? Yeah, are we in this? You are. Uh, you're still stunned, but that means that uh, just it doesn't mean any debuff for your attack, it means a buff against you. So, mm. you can act as if you're fine. Oh. Okay. So it just okay. lowers everything by one. Got it. Um, okay. Then I'm gonna try and I'm gonna try and bow down um, Zord. Okay. And I got a one. Let's go. Let's uh, go. Yeah, and it's and it's flow, yeah. so I get a second attack, right? Uh, no, flow doesn't give you a second attack. Flow just boosts your likelihood. It's a second attack for novice, for rolling something right, novice. You succeeded, a, you succeeded on a risky one. Oh, got and it. You just rolled that. 
Wait, did you just roll that bow at a novice level? I rolled my bow at a novice level. Because uh, you said because okay. you said I was buffed, so I had to uh, I had to roll everything one lower, and so I picked one of my higher ones, which is my bow, and I rolled it lower okay, at was, novice level. That was a miscommunication by me, but we're just gonna roll with that because it, it works. So okay. Uh, yeah, okay, yeah, you get a second attack. You're right. Okay, so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna knock another arrow and try and fire it at um, fire it at him, and I got a three, so I missed the second one. Whoa, swords at two. Uh, Zord is afraid, and he's going to uh, try and swim uh, behind the face for protection, forgetting that it is grabbing at him. Uh, and he is... Oh, he's going to get through, though. Uh, and he's now behind the tentacles. Uh, he's going to... Let's see, what's he going to do? He's going to throw his trident at... Uh, he's going to throw his trident at you, Skip. And... Mm -hmm. Miss! Fuck! Love that for me. Uh, Am I still? I got one more turn of rage. I think somehow. Yep, you do. Um, can I can I swim over and attack as in one big move to Zord? Um, yeah, I think the battlefield's small enough for that. We're not going to worry about moving speed for that. I jet, jet my way around the corner of the mask right to Zord, and I okay. attempt to grab his arm and and cleave it off in one. Love that. Okay. Um, wait, am I hitting on uh, D6? I forget. Uh, or did I yeah. go up to a triangle? Oh, oh, oh no, triangle you're still now? in the triangle. You're in rage. You're okay. still in blue triangle. Yeah. Okay, that's a three. That's a three. You, got him. you hit, baby. Cool. You hit, baby. So I'm just going just gonna to grab by the arm and just hack it clean off if <laughs> possible. You, ah, you cleave his arm and he, uh, Zord falls over, fainted, armless. And Need Zord's a hand, out. friend? I have yours, bitch! You still have to beat my fish! And he snaps. Well, one of them's uh, grappled, the right? Fish. Yeah, one of them is grappled. But uh, he snaps. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, as the Come swordfish in. swims right for you, Bromst, and okay. gets you for four, which I think is going to skewer you. I am dead. No, wait. <laughs> Bromps, don't you have a dodge or a, or a block you can use? I was in rage. Not I was not able no, to uh, do right. items or abilities. Okay. All right, Skip. Um, it's up to us. Skip's going to Skip's gonna throw a trident okay. right at that fish. Okay. I'm going to try and get lucky like I was before. <sighs> it's a four. Fuck. Okay. Um, so Skip's still in Skip right just now. whips it. Uh, no, that is a failed roll, so now... Oh, actually, you, yeah, you should be rolling that at a novice. I don't know. Oh, you okay. Yeah, because you're in <laughs> No, I did not. I did not. So I'm going to try, <laughs> try throw that at novice. It's a one. <laughs> oh my god, damn it. That's right. You get it. None of us are there. Are you sure it was a one? <laughs> it's a one. <laughs> okay. You hit him for three, uh, and now you get a second attack. <laughs> Wait, um, no, it's a trident. I get, I get damage, I get more damage against sea creatures, don't I? That's right, you get, you hit him for five. Uh, okay, so, so that now... fish is now at, he's at half, half. health? Yeah, he's at five. Okay, um, then I'm gonna do, I'm gonna just try and swim up and dagger it. Um, okay. And I'm rolling, I'm still in flow, so I roll at a higher level, right? Yeah. Okay. And yeah, that one hits, I got a two, so. Okay. Um, uh, and that's I'm gonna hits, just right? dagger it. Sweet. Yes, my dagger Swarms. is two damage. Okay. Cool. So it's it's at three health now. Cool. Excellent. The barracuda is gonna try to escape, but it doesn't have good chances, and it cannot. It Love is still that. grappled. Beautiful. Noe, I think you're the only one left uh, with a turn this. No, I, I failed my turn at the beginning. Oh, of that's right, you did. Okay, we're fresh then. Okay, cool. Barracuda's going to try to escape again. Yeah, Barracuda right. does not succeed. It is still grappled. Um, I'm going to try and shoot. <laughs> no, am I? I don't know. Yeah, I'm going to try and shoot the fish in front of me. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's a four, I miss. <laughs> Wait, but you're still in flow. So you should roll am it at a, at a oh, six. Oh, yeah. shit. Well, it lasts until a failed How long roll. does that have? Oh, okay. 
So yeah. I'm rolling practiced at two thirds. I got a four. I'd shoot that fish, baby, okay. for three. Uh, you, so one you executed. Yeah. And then. And now the only um, thing left is the grapple gun. Yeah, so you guys should just swim up and. swim up and uh, shoot that fish in the head. <laughs> okay, uh, I guess I will. Um, I'm gonna use my hypno stick on it that is now no longer. Um, right. under Wait, but it's grappled. Just hit it. <laughs> But if it escapes, I can I can basically I can have it hurt itself. No, if it's hypno, like can I do a hurt itself in confusion? Yeah. I yeah. guess yeah. <laughs> Pokemon it. Yeah, and it'll also protect us even more if if. That's if true. I okay. Yeah, yeah. And all my yeah. Now's the time to take for damage. Like I, I'm sort of a support class with this setup. Like I can't really hurt them. I guess I could tr try to try okay. it, but I think I have better chances with this. Except I don't because I fail for the oh, no. fifth it's supposed time to be a in a row. <laughs> Two thirds, right? Yes, I've hit four fives now on all of my. <laughs> Do you rig dice? <laughs> no hit though today. Uh, all right, we're fresh now. Again. Okay, um, Skip's gonna. I'm still in flow, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna go up and try and shoot it with my other pistol because I have two. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna get a four, so that hits for three. Okay. So he's uh, it's seven. seven. Okay. He's gonna cool. try to escape. God, it just cannot escape. I love this. Are you just doing that? I'm not even uh, hearing you rolling dice. Are you just no, saying? Well, I'm just rolling on the No, oh, well, okay. it, it's so it's, I, it's it has to taste. roll dexterity to flip out, and its dexterity is a red triangle, so it's only one in four. Oh, got it. But I am rolling after every attack you take. <laughs> So it's back in okay. two sets again, yeah? Back to you, no, uh, no it's yeah. you, no, no, me, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, okay, I guess I will... I can, all I can, the only thing I have that's not on cooldown right now is my trident, basically. So I'm just gonna try my trident. <laughs> just try it. Let's see how this goes. Oh! Finally! Yes! Trident hits! Alright, yeah. hits for five. Yep. Yeah. So he's down to one, uh, he's down to two. Yeah, and you get a second attack, yeah. right? Because it's a novice. Oh, yes. But I don't have... Oh, I guess I could just do something that's not one of my, like... Uh, uh -huh. You can just strength... So. You can just well, strength it. Also, you also get into flow, so it resets all your stuff. Oh, it resets all my stuff. Okay, cool. Uh, I'm just going to do go. my Morning Star, then, for two, two damage. Please, Morning cool. Star. I failed so many times. Just work. No! <laughs> Unbelievable! <laughs> Unreal! Oh my god, it still can't okay. get out. I'm gonna uh, roll it one more time. It's ridiculous. Oh my god. I'm gonna try my, I'm gonna try my hot dice. I'm gonna try my hot yeah, dice and go up and um. Two HP. Yeah, I'm gonna roll. I'm just try, gonna try not to mess this up. I'm just gonna go up with my dagger. I'm rolling it on proficient because I'm in flow. Um, okay. I got a three, so I'm just gonna shink um, for two damage. There we go. You skewer. The Barracuda. What's what's so funny is I'm just thinking of our characters doing this fight scene and Skip is just like like with his tail, like, you know, doing the water polo thing where you're swimming in place and he's just like yeah, he's like, like gun, trident, stab, like <laughs> while it's stuck in like a tentacle. Oh Nick, I have a I have like a maybe a balancing question or something that I just realized. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um Hit me. So my morning star attack mm -hmm. it is it's a green square, so it's it's um whatever good or uh proficient and it does two damage but then all my attributes like say say instead of using my morning star i just do huh. like a strength like i just punch it like yeah. you know a regular one of those would that also do like two damage yeah which probably makes me think i would i think you're getting at the morning star should probably do more yeah because it's got a three because it's got a cooldown so it's like there's no reason that i yeah. should ever use it basically because i could just use strength over and over again no you're totally right um, all your your attributes also have a cooldown, oh. um, but uh, but I do think that that is that is a good balancing point either way. Okay, cool. Um, yeah, because you should be in your the, you should be. Alive. How but do we know what the cooldown is on our attributes? It's a hard three for all of them. Oh, okay. Well, then, yeah. yeah, that makes way more sense balancing wise. But I, yeah, I still feel like Morning Star should do maybe like three. For sure, I, I think you're right. 
um, yeah, this is, uh, I mean, I had fun. I hope you guys did too. I felt like that was fast, yeah. but yeah, you know, it's definitely a, a new thing. So like, uh, hit me with any, any balance notes you have or like things that, you know, you think yeah. should be included or simplified or taken out or whatever. Kind of feel for about the end there. Definitely. Yeah. It definitely became easier just yeah. drilling it a couple times. Thanks for building in an episode where we can just sure. test that out. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I was really feeling like I was understanding it by that last fight there. It was super fun. Like, once you kind of have all the, like, symbols memorized yeah. where you kind of know what they mean. I think the one thing yeah. that, I'm, that I think still could use some tweaking is this, um, like, timer bar thing. Just because I totally. feel like we yeah. naturally yeah. take, you know, like, it sort of is at odds with the idea of, like, creative attacks because we're mm -hmm. we're like incentivized to just do like a really simple fast thing instead of something that might be a little have more explanation and like be a little bit more fun sure. and creative so i don't know i don't really yeah. know how to reconcile that but everything else works that's really not well, yeah I think. that's only that's the only thing i really missed and like felt like we missed out on was um like more creative attacks and then um mm -hmm. and then uh the opportunity well like when i pinned his tail to the ground and got him stuck, it's like, I still think that should like hurt the person. So maybe sure. it's like a half damage situation and then they're pinned. Um, uh, I don't know. That's no, I think, I think that's the only to, thing. I think you're right. Um, I think probably we could, I felt like we didn't really use the timer at all. And maybe what we could do in place is if you wanted to do like a, a coordinated attack like together for plus damage maybe you can just mm -hmm. maybe we can just make a decision like okay this one we're gonna yeah. do a coordinated attack because yeah. because you get the enemy gets buffed anyway so we don't really need yeah. to maybe like make fast you can just make the decision that like we're gonna attack together you know right i, like I also that. don't know if there's like yeah or if i don't know if there's like an issue with um this fighting style that's definitely more simplified but like still rolling initiative because my only thing was like i couldn't remember who had gone yeah, so sure. i i wonder point. if rolling and like foregoing the timer like you said because we were not really using it um and somehow still rolling initiative so we can remember who's gone in each turn but like i i don't know how we could I do. I like the idea of doubling damage for like people going in a quick amount of time. I don't know how that would work out, but yeah, that's my only. Those are my thoughts. Cool. Thank you for yeah. those. Yeah. Um, I think there's definitely a way. I think I feel like there's potential here, but I definitely agree that there yeah. needs to be some refinement. So. Um, yeah, but it was fun. You, it was really uh, fun. Yeah, yeah this and that's is really crazy that you. That's. To me, that's crazy that you thought of that as a fighting mechanic. Like you were just yeah. like, okay, how does D and D work now, and how can we make something a little quicker that geared toward improvisers and comedians playing this game? And so you're right. I definitely spent a lot less time looking at my character sheet and being like, and I roll for damage, and it's and it's a D and it's a D four. Got it. Like because so, that takes away so much of it. So kudos yeah. to you, man. That's that I'm sure was not easy. <laughs> Oh, as per Good. usual, amazing job, Nick. Thank you, guys. Well, you know, I uh, I appreciate it, but I do like I do want to hear your your thoughts and your criticisms because this is a, a team oh, effort. I just gave and... them to you. I just gave them to cool. you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching and for tuning in um, and working with us as we put together this new system. Uh, we'll be back in two weeks. Although we didn't even do our little uh, wrap out here. Hold on. Okay, let's get back into the scene for a Sorry. second. So the room fizzles out. The room fizzles out. And Zord, uh, Zord comes to and his arm remanifests. I'm dead. Well, <clears throat> I'm dead. I suppose that's two to three. I guess you win. Skip, Skip's going to try and spit again, but it's going to do the same thing where it just kind of fizzles in the air. Didn't work you the first time. Learn very fast, do you? <laughs> well, gang, I suppose that means that you are official warriors. Uh, here, I think, is an opportunity for us to take some time and train you to boost your different skill sets. Uh, and that oh. is what we will come back to next time. All uh, right. 
Yay! So thank you, ladies oh, and gentlemen, yeah. for tuning in. Thanks, we'll guys. And thank you, Nick. Of course. Thank you, Thanks, guys, Nick. for playing along and being good improvisers. Absolutely. Hey, we love you. <laughs> Everybody we'll see each other. We'll see you in two weeks. Uh, thank the dice. Normal show yeah. on Sunday. Yes, I'm sure Everything Now Show, 7 p.m. I think we're doing auditions, which will be very fun. Yeah, and, uh, very fun idea and play. Join the Discord. And yeah, uh, see who we can raid. And who can we raid? On Monday for Rocky Sucks at Photoshop, I have uh, Harley, Bread Witchery, and all three Shrimp Boys. So oh my god. Chaos. That is a stacked cast. We can't even get them on our I ain't show. bucking around. Yeah, I know. I'm trying to like leverage the, you know, I'm trying to get more people back to the show. Oh my god. So we'll see. I love the, I love all of those people. The good folks. Let's good blokes. See. Raid Wavy, our friend Wavy Lions probably doing collaborative writing. Oh, yeah. We can raid Wavy. They online. They are online. Yeah, let's raid Wavy. According to Aiden. Thanks, Aiden, and thank you all for watching. See you Sunday. Thanks, guys. See you See Sunday. You soon, folks. See you soon. Nick, I really love the fish behind you. Such a great touch. Yeah, yeah you being in an aquarium. So, right? so, so good. You being in an aquarium is so, so funny. Okay, bye, everybody. We love the so... shrimp boys. So long. And.